Hello everyone, this is Mr. Masonette, and today we are going to practice multiplying binomials together. We are going to use the example x plus 4 times x minus 5. Now when multiplying binomials, we have an acronym which can help us remember the steps to binomial multiplication, and that term is called FOIL. Now it only works with a binomial times a binomial, it does not work with a binomial times a trinomial, or a mononomial times a binomial. So what we're going to do is practice this acronym to successfully multiply these binomials together. And we're going to start, of course, with the F, or the first terms. And the first terms are these terms right here. In this set of parentheses, this is our first term. And in this set of parentheses, this is also our first term. So we multiply those together first. X times X is X to the second power. Next, we move on to the O, or the outer terms. Now, when you think about the outer terms and the inner terms, you should look at both of these binomials as a whole. So we're going to group these together. We consider these terms the outside terms and these two terms the inner terms. So let's start by multiplying the outer terms together, which of course are x and negative 5. Negative 5 times x is negative 5x. Now we're going to move on to the inner terms. The inner terms are positive 4 and positive x. And the product of those two terms are positive 4x. And of course, we move on to our last terms. Now we started with the first terms, which are the first terms inside each set of parentheses. So of course, the last terms are the last terms in each set of parentheses. In this case, positive 4 and negative 5, which gives us a product of negative 20. Now, once you have your first product, your outer product, your inner product, and your last product, what you do is you have to combine any like terms that may be present. And of course, the only like term we have here is an x value. Negative 5x and positive 4x, when putting those together or combining them, gives us negative 1x. And x to the second power does not have any like terms to combine with, and nor does negative 20. Now remember, whenever you have 1 as a coefficient, you really don't need it. So our final product of x plus 4 and x minus 5 is x to the second power minus x minus 20. And that's how you multiply a pair of binomials together. 